Hello and welcome back. Um, this this game I think is loud when it launches. Watch out! Watch out! Is it loud? I know no one sees me. No, it's not that loud. That's fine. Hello. Oh, is this a non-widescreen game? <laughs> Wait, can I not use a controller for this game? Hello? Gamepad 01? I went into the other room to get a little more light. It's, even though we have a lot of light in this room... Oops. You have to have, like, direct light on your eyes to do eye makeup. It's annoying. <laughs> he looks so cute. Can they see him? Yes. Oh, 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 oh you don't have to come over to me. It's okay. He wants to say hi to us. Yeah. Hi, Sweezen. Hi, committed. Hi, <laughs> you committed. changed that soundtrack. This is the... Hi, no! I like the remastered. <laughs> I do love it. It's basically... Here, we'll compromise. I'll do this one. Which is which is which is worse to admit on stream your political party affiliation or whether you do remaster or original on game story? <laughs> Honestly, they're both pretty hard to talk about. <laughs> yeah, we'll we'll play with the Cave Story Plus um, soundtrack, which independent voter. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. That won't spark any controversy. Yeah, I can't. Hold on. I jump. Fire. Up. Left. Swap left. Swap right. Oh, it already knew that I wanted up and down. Okay, it, it already did that. I already Pause. Map. Mm, yeah. Yay. Now I can use the D pad. New is the Jill Stein of Game Story soundtracks. <laughs> Amazing. Oh no, Town Tree, please. Oh, that's why it wasn't loud. Now it's loud. I don't know why we had it so, like, low. Um. I think sharp looks better. Even though it's it's even less of the screen. I think I don't like stretch. It, starts, it looks all blurry. Right? Well, everything looks blurry to me right now. I have my glasses on. Oh. Uh, I agree that sharp looks better. I agree. Yeah, I think sharp looks better. Okay. Agree. Okay. Um. Here we go. <laughs> I'm too. <laughs> if you change the difficulty level to hard, the cancel button becomes I'm too afraid. Stop <laughs> Hard. I don't think I'll be playing on hard. I think I'll have. A, I think I'll have a hard enough time with original. <laughs> I don't have this game memorized like some people. Not, not her. Her family. Yeah. 180 attempts on the core on heart. Jeez. Whew. Okay. Someone's transmission. Connecting to network. Logged on. Starting IM chat. This is for a did game you, from 2004. Did you explain uh, why you are, like, I gotta beat the... Um, what is it the which boss are you going to? I haven't for? even like started saying that now. Oh. Do you think we should say it now, like to them? There's a reason Alex is playing this game today. Because it's the twentieth anniversary of Cape Story, of course. Well in December. Which is basically now. Who do you watch uh that inspired you? <laughs> you don't have to say it like that. Oh sorry. You can just say. Well, um, I actually don't know the name of the boss and exactly what challenge this. 
Oh, um, yeah, because Vinny played it recently. Um, I didn't even know he was a fan of this game, which is funny. Kazoomer. Kazoomer. <laughs> uh, Kazoomer. Oh, that's his name. <laughs> um, but yeah, I when I played this, it was like, I don't know, it was like 2011 or something. I played this on Steam, just like, you know, as part of my growing up. Um, and I never beat the true ending. I tried, I looked up how to do it, and I played, like, some of it, and I could not beat the final dungeon, and I was like, this is too hard, I don't, I don't care anymore. <laughs> I but stopped you, playing the game. You replayed it kind of recently. Yes? Did I? Maybe. We did, we did a cave story stream. I don't know if you finished it. I don't know if it. we finished it. I don't think yeah, we did. I don't think we finished it. I think Miri was over. And then Miri showed off um, Boss Rush. Yeah. So. Yeah, she's she's uh, pretty... Um, cracked at the game. Cracked, thank you. I was trying to think of a non-vulgar way to say Cave sorry. Cave sorry. Miri was a legend. Cave sorry is if you ever land and... in the same space. That's another robot they'd send you back to the beginning. And, um... Uh, Truman just got the first ending. I'm sorry, Tao Trant got the first ending. The the, the coward's right on, ending. On hard mode. On hard mode. Which Red is not playing on hard mode. He's gonna get the... No. Because on, on hard mode, you don't get to pick up any of the health refills, so basically everything kills you in one hit. Cave Sorry is Canadian Cave Sorry. <laughs> Shooting for Blood Stained Sanctuary, I think so, yeah. We're gonna we're gonna save Curly and save the island and basically save the world. Okay, I didn't realize like the first line is already gonna be controversial, because I always um I always thought this person's name should be pronounced Sue. Because this is, like, extremely Japanese. Well, let's look at where her name is actually in Japanese. Oh, true. We can do that. I get to make that joke. Can you even be Baldos? Yeah. Japanese name. Sue. Wow, it's just... Sue. Her name is Sue, Alex. Okay. Well, there we go. And it's the katakana for Sue. Her name is Sue. <laughs> Okay. Sue? <laughs> Are you there? It's me. Oh, it's Kazuma! Good luck to you and Miriam, Tautriant. Oh my god. I was somehow able to escape, but I got lost. I'm in a shelter without anything inside. You're reading this. Please answer. Please? There's just like a room in the in that area have to put in the earbuds right away because I know the music in this game is everything. I can I can die without even leaving the first room. Isn't that amazing? And it's amazing. Yeah, it's pretty great. And will it make you watch the cutscene over again? It would if I hadn't saved. Oh. Okay, I'm not gonna do it though. You don't have a death voice yet? It is it is not a good enough joke. True ending, here we go. <laughs> yeah, Sui does sound like calling a pig after glow. Sui? <laughs> yeah. No, it was Sui. You don't get that on hard mode. That's why we're not playing hard mode. <laughs> There's only one health capsule in hard mode, and it's the one a dog gives you. Ooh. Jump is very floaty in this game. Which is good, because it's your main way of dodging things. Give me the health capsule, please. I need it, says so Tautrian. Guy's asleep. Which means we can legally take his stuff. I don't think that means that, but I'm taking it anyway. I got the cola star. <laughs> the soda gun. More simultaneous story. Searching for Sue. One Sue found. I'm smart. Sue, answer me. They're looking for you. Are you asleep or what? Your brother's so lonely. What you said, okay? 
thanks for the gun, old man. Oh, never mind. We're not on the same plane. If I'd seen it go live just a moment earlier, I would have rated you too bad to glow. <laughs> that's happened to Red before. Yeah. Where he's where he's like, oh, there's no one to raid. That's fine. That's alright. And right. then goes offline, and then someone else goes live like the instant after. He's like, God <laughs> damn it. Yeah. The Doritos. The Doritos make your weapons more powerful, but you drop some of them when you get hit. I don't even need that. Don't even need it. Is there? Would there oh, you even... can pose your question to Tell Trant and Miri right now about if they figured out the connection with the red flowers that you realized. Oh yeah, man. Are we getting into spoilers already? I guess I don't know if there's I anybody think here. Everyone like... here has seen the game. Thor is staring at you, and I find that uncomfortable. Yeah, you've seen all of, like, two doors. No, just the one! This is the only door, because the other thing is, uh, down there, is like a lion head. So, there's only been one door in the entire game. Fucking door mimic. Yeah, instantly. The game teaches you to be very afraid. Yeah. Wh why? It doesn't even attack you. It just does contact damage. You need to respect the game, Red. And it's the only door mimic in the game, so that explanation doesn't even make any sense. <sighs> anyway, um, here's the here's the connection I just made recently when watching Vinny's playthrough. So, um, close your ears if you don't want spoilers for this game. We're gonna be doing like a full story thing, so if it's your first time listening, watching, please just like. You're VOD watching? Skip. Skip until we're, like, out of this room. Um, red flowers grow on the island. The red flowers make um, the Mimiga really powerful, but also lose their minds. Um, that's not a coincidence. It's because um, Balus is in the island, and Balus's whole thing is that he's super powerful and insane, and he uses, like, a lot of, like, red magic. It's him inside the island that's making the flowers grow. There you go. That's the most of making the game order thing, right? Daisuke <laughs> Amaya thought it would be funny if there was a door mimic. Made it, never used it again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically. Um, this is this is one of the first like actual like one guy indie game. That took off games the way it did. That, like, yeah, that, that made people think, like, oh, wow, you can actually make a really good game despite not being a game studio or having any money. <laughs> <laughs> Solid theory could make sense. It's true to me. Because, yeah, I don't know. You, you, yeah. Mary thinks your idea makes sense. Cool. I, I, uh, I, I'm getting no negative responses, so we're all just going to consider that true from now on. We're yeah. going to make a pack. Can we go add that to the wiki, please? The grandfather of indie games. Yeah, pretty much. Come on, Sue! Type something, will you? Starting over here. I'm so hungry that, that I even ate a cockroach. This is as bad as Paper Mario when the little kids were surrounding the pig. No, just kidding! But just so you know, if I get to that point, I'll do it. Great writing. That's how truth works. I'm a big fan of that writing. Exactly. Give me the key. No way. You trying to protect that Sue girl? She's an outsider. Sue is a good person. I won't betray Sue. Toriko, next time that doctor shows up, someone else will be taken away. If Sue isn't turned in, you could be in danger. <laughs> It'll be turned into a pig. Sorry, everything is Paper Mario right now to me. <laughs> uh, but... Hand over the key. Hi. <laughs> the way the way they like bounce as yeah. they're moving. Oh, that's it's so, so cute. Good. You're just like, huh? Oh, oh. What? You're not an enemy. I thought you were one of them. My name's King. That's a good name. <laughs> Your parents must have must have had big dreams for you. I'm the number one in this village. Though I say number one, it doesn't really mean much. There are only six of us left in the village. Well, really, including Sue, it's seven, but she's not one of us. She's just an outsider that came into our village. Now there's eight of us. I Buddy? I don't think he feels like that. Buddy? Right in his face! 
Personal space! <laughs> Miri says, oh, the voice acting! Yeah, of course. The new graphics on Rectangle Toriko's head. Smooch! Smooch! Smooch the king on yeah. the ring. He needs, he needs a little kiss right on that triangle nose. That Toriko! She took advantage of the commotion and escaped. I don't think she took advantage of it. I think she kind of freaked out and ran in a direction. Same. You have to manual save in this game because it's old. And they didn't they didn't remake it like the Thousand Year Door. <laughs> the farm up here. I mean quick saves on PC were a thing. This one. He could have gone in that direction. I think he chose not to because he was emulating some of his favorite things. Yeah. There's white flowers and yellow flowers and blue flowers and a health capsule. I'm gonna take this. I don't think anybody needs it. Otherwise, someone would have already gotten it. Yeah. It's a sprinkler. Yeah, so that's what that is. Okay. Sprinkler. Remember that. That's going to be important later. It would stink if it auto-saved our big story decisions. Yeah, true. This is the farm where we grow flowers. My job is to protect this farm. Bless Mimiga, these flowers are a precious source of food. But not the red flowers. I heard that if we eat red flowers, our blood pressure skyrockets and we'll die in an instant. Fortunately, on this farm, we don't grow those vile red flowers. Good talk, man. What you drinking? Flower <laughs> it's, it's empty. We had the most delicious sample. Yesterday and today, uh, samples were happening because... Um, at the grocery stores we were shopping at. Yeah. Because um, we did some uh, grocery delivery yeah. together. Can't get up there. Um, and there was little, um, like, half a hot dogs with half a hot dog buns. And they were so good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's like the that's like the best uh, free food sample I've ever been given. It was yeah. like a yeah, basically like a, a third of a hot dog, and they even had ketchup and mustard nearby. Yeah, it was awesome. Let me get cemetery currently closed due to hazards. Look at this guy. I love. Look at how they gave him a tiny animation of his like glasses glinting in the light. He did. My name's Jack. I'm the number two in the village. Beyond here is Mimika Cemetery. There our hero Arthur rests eternally in peace. What am I doing here? Mushrooms have taken over Mimika Cemetery. So I'm keeping watch to make certain they don't come into the village. Can I go in? No. Wait. Did he say Jack before? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> I thought he gave a different name. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody in the assembly hall? Nah, it's this fire. Flames. There is something on the other side. Stick your hand in there. Don't remember that. That's probably not important. Wait. Everyone, forget there were, that. There were pots. No, you're not Link. Oh, I wanted rupees. How, how am I going to buy bombs? First try. Map system. Something's written. So long as you always maintain a sex sense of exploration, you will someday find the way out. This is my hope. Nice. Cool. Hey, there's uh, stuff, like, way up there in the top left. Intriguing. Well, probably not important, because I can't get there. <laughs> I don't see how that could be relevant. <laughs> there's nothing in here. That's great. Okay. Shack. Every, every village needs a shack. True. Abandoned shack. What are you doing over here, man? Mm, gulp. <laughs> Jeez, you scared me. Sue. Oh, you mean the girl staying at Arthur's house, right? She lives together with Toriko. That girl's a real cutie. She must be looking for flying dragons. What do you mean by that? Wonder if there really is if such a If you're a thing. cutie, you're looking for dragons. Those <laughs> things are correlated. Dragons that fly in the sky. Good talk, man. Okay. okay. Sometimes you talk to people twice and sometimes you don't. It's just like Earthbound. All 
Arthur's house. Oh, all right. Well, Except you have a gun, which makes it way, way more interesting to read. It's locked. <laughs> yeah, come on. <laughs> what if Ness had a gun? <laughs> It'd be a better game, that's what I'm saying. Actually, oh, here we go. So, is this game kind of a little bit in the same boat, uh, boat as, like, story-focused Metroidvanias, like, um... Samus's games, which I definitely remember Metroid games. I mean, that's where the word Metroid came from. I don't know. Is this game considered that? I don't know if I would it's really consider that. It's pretty different. It's pretty different. It's in its own genre. Yeah. You can't... There are, is, like, a distinct order in which you explore things in this game. Yeah. I... Sue? Yeah, Sue! That cute girl who's always hiding inside Arthur's house. Recently came to Mimiga Village. She fell into the reservoir there. I don't think she's very fond of us. Seems like she hates everyone in the village. But she's a Mimiga, same as the rest of us. Fell into the reservoir. Okay. Anyway, can I have this? A silver locket! Dubious chinfish. Silver locket in the shape of a fish. From the wear on it, the locket must have been dear to someone for many years. I'll, I'll, oh, did I'll we read Kamenda's previous message? Sure, hold nothing bad, having an old arty. Oh! Ah! Air 100. <laughs> A little question mark. Hand over that key. No! <laughs> it's on. a good thing no one takes fall damage in this game. Come on, King. Aren't you the number one? Ah, oh, Toriko! Don't underestimate me! I think she's correctly estimating you. Yeah. <laughs> Do you care about what just happened? No. No, he does not. Nope. It's okay. Just lying there dead, says Miri. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, I would probably not get up immediately if a little girl had just like, completely overpowered me <laughs> while I was trying to look tough. Ah, come on. Maybe kind of smarter, but I never thought about how the air meter is almost a Mr. Axe's commands. What do you mean? It will kill you if you reach zero, right? Are we talking about the fact that these characters are not human? <laughs> oh, <laughs> but why? That's true. It does display the message you have drowned if you die. Which, yeah, is very misleading. Okay, yeah, that's great. Mushrooms. That's great. I love that I just realized this. He's holding his hand up as if he has a gun, but he doesn't. <laughs> He's just, he's holding it like he does. <laughs> you can even see it in his little portrait. <laughs> he's just pointing continuously. No, that's that's definitely true. Yeah. I, I agree that that they would die, and, and that's very important to the story that they would, but calling it drowning is, is, misleading. is misleading intentionally. He's pointing like, hold on there, Jack. I actually don't know what to do next. Um, I have to go to the shack. Oh. Oh. Huh. Yes. Yes. Hi, Slowkey. You jerk. Okay, boss number one. Here we go. Ready? Oh, look at her. Oh my god, she's got the moves. She's got the moves. She's dash dancing. I can't even dash dance that fast. Okay. Uh, yeah. She's so caffeinated. Uh, okay, got her. Oh, you shouldn't have done that. That's oh, awful. Oh, oh, oh. I, oh would she, okay, she attacked me first, though, right? I, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here, man. <laughs> They'll never believe my side of the story. <laughs> wow, this is weird. <laughs> ah, oh, help me. Help me. Huh? You're not the doctor. Oh, sorry about that. The doctor's such a cruel and evil person. You should not say that about Doctor Who. 
He shows up, uh, not Dr. Ninja. He's just a little bit callous. He shows up in the village and kidnaps Amiga, at times even killing someone. At Doctor, times. He killed my older brother. Uh, that pendant. Did you pick it up for me? Yes. <laughs> Sue gave it to me. But I don't want it anymore. That must be why you threw it into the reservoir. King gets bent out of shape when Sue and I get along. Self-defense wheel, so... So, please keep it. Okay. Oh, yeah! I found you! It's no use hiding from me! I've got the nose of a clever harrier! That's you. Oh. Indeed. Yes, he has the nose and the brain of a dog. Misery! I found her first! You two! You're with the doctor! <laughs> She's like... Yeah. <laughs> you must be Sue. The Great Doctor has summoned you. Come along with me. Huh? But I'm not Sue! <laughs> this person's name is not Sue. I thought it was Toroko. Balrog, the rest is up to you. No, she gave a fake name. That's clever. <laughs> I'm the wrong person! I told you! Not this again. I always have to clean up. I'm the one who found her, not misery. The bar of soap always gets stuck with the cleanup jobs. That's true. Holy crap, minutes. <laughs> So what's up? You wanna fight me with that little pea shooter? No? Huh? Alright then, I'm gonna go back home. Okay. It's good that the door frame somehow survived. <laughs> That's a really good point. Why is the door frame still there? <laughs> oh, well it's not out here. <laughs> I mean it kind of is. Somehow. <laughs> he was so real for that. <laughs> Yeah, he's like, yeah, do you want to fight me? And you say no, and he's like... Yeah, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> because there really is no reason for him to fight you there. She's like, oh, I'll leave the rest to you. And he's like, yeah. Wait, I, I'm just gonna leave. You can just stay here. I... Really no reason to do any more. Hey, that girl got kidnapped. He doesn't care. Oh, he does care. Huh? He Toriko's does care. been kidnapped! Uh, now the only girl left in the entire village is Sue. That's rough. Not creeps out of the shadows, although no clue how long. I've woken up because of headache and these 8-bit sounds don't help, actually. Oh, I'm That's sorry. That's fair. I'm really sorry you're dealing with that. Does it hurt your ears when I do this? It actually sounds nice. <laughs> oh, I can't, like, I can't make, like, a clink noise. What did you say? Toriko's been kidnapped? That's terrible! We have to inform King! Hmm. Yeah, definitely leave this door unlocked. Now I can go see the mushrooms. There actually are mushrooms, how about that? And you wanna see you wanna see a fun thing? It's not this guy. This guy's not fun. I always thought this guy was invincible. Oh. But he's not. You just shoot him in the back. Ah. Stop that! <laughs> He's bouncing into me. Got him. It's fun watching you mash the fire button. Okay, you want to see the fun secret? Wait. No, it's fun. Hold on. It's it's hard to see the fun secret. There, there it is. See that? Oh, it's so tiny. Yeah, I do see that. There's a little tiny guy there. If you interact with him, he says, Can I help you? What is he exactly? He's a tiny man. Oh. <laughs> That's all. Small males is coming in. <laughs> Arthur's grave. Something's written on the headstone. Here rests the true Mimiga hero, Arthur. Found Arthur's key. 
they buried him with it, I guess, or, well, probably not. I that hope that that's, I'm... yeah, I hope that's on the surface. Yeah, well, <laughs> I do what I have to, all right? Meet his family later and they give you a gun. <laughs> it's true. The nicest Sriracha, thing a stranger can do. If somebody, if, if a stranger uh, offered you my safe return, would you give them a gun? Yeah, probably. Cool. Oh, this is a great meeting, you guys. It's a bad gun, though. This isn't here. No, it's not. It shoots ducks. How can it be bad? N not, not like it. It shoots. It ducks come out of the gun. You need to be clear. <laughs> uh, Toriko, too. Toriko's older brother. Arthur was our strongest warrior. He was killed by the doctor himself. I wasn't even able to protect Toriko. There are two keys to Arthur's house. Toriko has one of them, the other's inside maybe a cemetery. Thank you, you for letting us know that, Jack. Right now? He's like, I really hope if I subtly hint to this stranger that they will do that for me, because I don't want to go in there. Wee. Ow. My knees! Wait, is there fall damage? No. Okay. Wait. King kinda has that sonic side mouth thing going on this minute. Yeah, <laughs> he does! <laughs> side mouth. I bet, I bet fishing Mimiga would like to know that Horiko has been kidnapped. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This is a story run because we're getting the true ending. Nope. You don't care. So wait, six? What are you, the paper boy, Siska Minutes? <laughs> yeah. Why not? Someone extra, extra. Do. Read all about it. So I was there. And wasn't able to stop it. He says there are six people. There's King, there's Jack, there's the eating guy, there's the fishing guy. Who else? What do you... What, what do you there are two... Oh! And, but they've been kidnapped? No worries, Nock. Hope your head feels better soon. Because Sue doesn't count. He calls Sue the seventh. Yeah. Who else? Who else does he mean? <laughs> Bye, knock. I do like the music, but are we loud enough to be heard over the music? It might be a little loud. And the sound effects are good too. We want to make sure to be able to hear the sound effects. This is an old game, so you can't go to the options while you're playing the game. You have to quit the game to do that. That is annoying. I need that one health. Good. One health will save your life. Uh, how do you quit? You can't! Do you, do you... Oh, I know what you do. Don't, there's, don't. There's an easy way to quit. No, don't do that way. Oh! What's that on this? I hit the escape button, in case you're wondering what I did. <laughs> that should be good. Oh, I was on... Was I on original? I guess so. <laughs> I don't even know. Oh, I was! <laughs> Whoa! Come on, isn't this better? This is, this is Mary me by... says... I noticed. This is made by Danny B. Interesting choice, she writes. Isn't this? This is Danny B. Danny Baranowski? Maybe? Hold on. Uh... Donkey Pong writes Slowkey? Yes, this is Danny B. He also made the music for The Necrodancer, right? Yeah! He's Crypt of the Necrodancer. He made the amazing, incredible soundtracks for uh, the, like, kind of forgettable puzzle game Mighty Switch Force <laughs> and its sequel. But the soundtracks are incredible. Yeah. 
Uh, he does the Shantae stuff too, I think. No. Wait, does he? No, I'm- hold on. He doesn't do Mighty Switch for us in Shantae. I'm getting him mixed up with... I'll get him. Uh... <laughs> Am I? <laughs> I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm getting he's everybody mixed up. Funny, but in the best way. I don't remember... I don't remember names and people. I'm, I have a brain that doesn't work. You're doing just fine. Jake Kaufman does the Mighty Switch Force yeah, OST. Yeah, never mind. But Danny... Danny B. Ross... No, that's not how you spell his name. He, it's Baranowski. He did Super Meat Boy! <laughs> yep. There we go. I can't read this, apparently. Wikipedia has a dark mode now. I apparently can't look at this either. Oh, there we go. Flowers? <laughs> Three question marks? <laughs> that's awesome, because that's our character's inner thoughts. It's like... Oh? <laughs> that's great. Can I sleep in the bed? Yeah. Great. That's really funny because there's a life thing over there, but I can still sleep in the in the beds if I want for the immersion. Text is displayed on screen. Our computer's great, but just so you know, if I get to that point, I'll do it. Allow teleportation to egg corridor. I don't see why not. It seems like the kind of permission I can grant. Now accessible via teleport. That sounds good to me. Let's go. Let's freaking It's a teleporter. Go. Teleport to the egg corridor. Yeah, I dude, I love eggs. Scrambled? Fried? Oh no, these ones are alive. Never mind. Hey, who's this? Watch out for that little white thing moving back and forth below. Its touch is as deadly as it gets. Alright, sure. Animal cruelty. Why are there elephants he here? He was gonna attack you first. Why yeah. are there dinosaur eggs here? Um, or dragon eggs, Well, because it's the egg corridor! <laughs> what do you mean, why are there eggs here? You don't know asked about the elephants. Well, the elephant- it's not elephant corridor! Ah! Nice job. You wait, he has to go farther before he turns around and comes back and get you. It's just going to Rama. Those, um, blocks look like sad faces. Riyad sad faces. Oh yeah, I guess if you look at the top part, yeah. Look at these little like jelly boys that just like jump. They're so cute. Oh, I have I have I have the super gun now. Yes, you do. You're you're screwed. I haven't dropped my Doritos. I can't think of another game that does that. Where your gun also, levels you up, the better you do. You just ride these doing? guys. Kind of, what are you doing? You can ride these guys. See, it doesn't hurt. You were getting hurt. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt except for when it does. <laughs> Bouncy money says the, okay. Those those guys are basically just walking like Dorito stashes. I may have walked in at an awkward yeah, moment. Yeah, you may have. I think that girl's having a fight with her boyfriend. You think that's what's happening here? I don't know, I'm not good with people. <laughs> On. I should be able to shoot him from here. Ah! There you are, you monster. You don't scare me. <laughs> what? <laughs> you want some of this? Take your best shot. Even my big brother has never beaten me. Ouch! You got me. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Pow! Huh? Who are you? <laughs> this kind of butt kick is just like... I haven't seen you around before. Ah! I... Oh. Well, if I'm just standing here watching this happen. Yeah. Gun in hand, just like, just like... you and me cool. Alright, see you later. 
Don't know what to make of this. This is Cthulhu's abode. Of course. This, of course, it, hey, this is highly unusual. You're a soldier from the surface, are you not? Where is your blonde pal? Ho ho ho. What? You lost your memory? Eh, eh. He knows, what do you mean by heh eh? He knows a lot of things. Yeah. He knows I'm a soldier. He knows I'm from the surface, whatever that means. Uh, oh, because we're in a cave, of course. Um, and yeah, that's why. We apparently have a blonde pal. Well, you better wander around till the batteries run out. What is that supposed I'll to be? I'll have you know, my batteries recharge whenever I go to sleep, okay? Like every normal robot. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what? I don't know what you mean by robot. I'm a soldier from the surface. Uh-huh. I'm so good at this jump. This would be how I do this jump, too. <laughs> He's like, ha, you missed the jump again. Oh my god, I keep jumping too early try. now. Let me- oh, are we at give me the controller no, levels of not because, bad already? not because I'm gonna do better, but because, like, it'll be funny. Oh, nice. There we go. I'm so good. You are so good. Now I don't have to be that jerk Cthulhu ever again. You didn't like him very much, did you? He... He said, heh hey, better wander around till the batteries run out. It was obviously... Uh, Talking about your 3DS. He, he, no, he, he, he was obviously... Adversarial. Your friend on the bottom keeps following you, he says, Miri, you should give it a hug. Yeah, he definitely wants one. Look, we can go in the egg. In the egg! This egg isn't even a real egg. It's an ID card egg. Gotta put your ID card somewhere. I think I might do an experiment where I cook myself an egg pretty thoroughly and eat it and see if I get sick. That sounds like an experiment in which you hurt yourself. Well, I'm just curious. You're not curious. You're 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 sad and afraid. You wish to eat eggs again. I love eggs. He was a big dude. He had a lot of Doritos Maybe in him. Maybe I'll wait until I'm no longer pregnant to too, do that. Too bad I don't need any eggs. This is the egg observation room. That's cool. Um, Time to observe. Red flower petals litter the floor. Hmm. He's eating red flowers. There's a note here. Oh, his blood pressure spiked. That poor guy. That's what they said would happen. <laughs> no! You can't really get any closer to the observation room because of the shield. There should be a terminal that can remove the shield somewhere. There should be, but is there? <laughs> Flying dragon egg number eight. Egg stasis, normal. I like how they specify it's flying. For nine, normal. Yeah, flying dragons. Egg normal, normal, sure, normal, great, normal, normal, that's what I expected, normal, uh-huh, normal, great. Uh, that's just a normal missile launcher. Just your average missile launcher. Yep. I've never actually interacted with that computer, it's Miri! <laughs> Um, I love that uh, a game developer just tells you the special niche that the rocket launcher is supposed to fit in. Hey, it's very powerful and it has limited ammo. It's like, okay, great. I probably could have figured that out for myself, but I'm really proud of you for programming it. Normal. Abnormal. Normal. <laughs> hey, wait a second, what? <laughs> Examine further. Oh, that's is that where you got the key card? Yeah. Get the key card oh, from. And number and one. Number one. Which is also one you checked. Uh. That's the that? first one you went in, right? No, I think they're. In reverse order. In reverse order, yeah. Oh, you're right. Three. You're right. Some of my new missile launcher. Oh yeah! 
Oh no, the big, the big Dorit. No Dorit. <laughs> wow, you really got that Dorit. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. Wow, look at you. Yeah, level two missiles. Level down. Ow. Level up. Level down. Level up. <laughs> Yeah, those guys really they don't like aggro upon seeing you. They don't they they do one damage only from the side. Those things are just walking Dorito containers. That is their purpose in life. I need to scroll the screen over here so that you No! Okay, I need to scroll the screen this way so that you go all the way that way. And then I've tricked you and I'm going to go get uh -huh. egg number one. I fooled you. There's one missile in here. Hm. Oh well. Okay. You gotta put the ID card in the egg, and then it. Then you can go get the thingy. Progression! Heck yeah. Nice, fast draw. There we go. Hey! Oh my god. I'm gonna go get like one more Dorit. Um, you can collect Doritos even when your uh, weapon is at max, because that's basically your little shield, so you don't lose it instantly. Is there just like an angry face on these? Is that what they're supposed to be? Is it supposed to be like a, a ho like a bird? Like a hawk or something? Or is it just supposed to be an angry face? Is this like... Is this literally just like, this is the angry face square because it's the boss? <laughs> anyway. Look at this dude. <laughs> Professor, very important death tag! Very important! Hold anyone near him! Yeah. This guy's a little help. Oh, well. A little bit more. I got him! Oh, he was just a little boy! Defeated Igor. What a Igor. Yep, he's gone. He's fine. That'll show you. Ah, uh, won't open. But it's the save point! Egg number zero. I don't know why this one's important. Uh. Ouch. Well there. I haven't lost yet. I'm gonna take it serious now. Hey girl, happy 4th of July. Heck yeah, thanks for gigantifying the Evo 11. What's up, girl? Huh? Huh? I knocked out by that monster. Yep. Did you save me? Yeah. This is none of your business! Oh. I can take care of myself. Yeah, I saw that. I hit the silent and every living thing on it! And you're a living thing on oh. it. Oh! This, this must be it. Take them for zero zero. Yeah, this is Miri's game, it's true. And Truman. And Megan. And Becca. We can get off the island with this Ra egg. Rachel also, I'm pretty sure. What, can it, like, float on the water? The condition is normal. Awesome. Awesome! Hmm. Ah, huh, password? It looks like I need a password to hatch this egg. Try one, two, three, four. Meh. Nah. If my big brother were here, he'd fix everything. Nothing to do here. I guess I'm out. Okay, bye! Um, are you from the silent? No, you apparently I'm from the like surface. Letters on your cap aren't from here. You're lost? Fine. I'll let you come with me. We can get out of the silent together, if you want. When I'm returned, you're gonna have to help me. Oh, look at Eleven's reaction to Mary's <laughs> reaction to Eleven's so awesome. Hatching preparations complete. Input password. I'm frogging out. 
Here's a fun thing. The first time you come into this room, you can examine this. And it says a cold cold breeze blows through, because there's secretly a door there, you just don't know it. Wait. Can you look at whatever this is? Nope. I have to get ready for party two, but I just wanted to spread some friendly propaganda. Is eleven? Nice. <laughs> this American flag. Heck yeah. I hope you have a lovely party part two. What is what is that little bit right there? It's probably unnecessary. Guess what? I'm actually okay at the game too, says Truman. Ah! Oh, goes. Dang right. The gang's all here, says Ellie. You sure hey! Are. <laughs> what a jerk. Do you see that? <laughs> I did see that. Yeah, Ooh, good dodge. I'll make some potato salad, says Ellie. Do that. Let me. I got two whole cave story gamers on the stream chat and two more streaming, says Tao Tree. That's right. I have not played this game, though. I've oh, only watched. Oh, you play this game? They encouraged me to play it. I think I started a couple times, but. I just, uh. I, I love. I do love the aesthetic. The music's incredible. The art's incredible. The story's great. So you can just bounce right off this Oh, sorry. I just haven't, uh, dialed it and played it for myself. Yeah. Yeah, Becca did play it a lot. They should add this to Archipelago's glow. Ooh. Yeah, that would be a thing. Hey, thanks, bud. It is pretty linear. See, okay, look, I'm not a robot. You can unlock weapons. Because that guy's a robot, and I look nothing like him. So whatever you have to tell yourself. Okay. It's too linear. <laughs> Never mind. Is it part of Archipelago? Um. Asuma. Are you there? It's not. Oh, okay. Cause yeah, you can you can like randomize like teleporters and stuff. I bet you could make a decent randomizer out of this game. Sue? Is that really you, Sue? Yeah, it's me. Sue Sakamoto, your sis. So you were able to escape too? Where are you at now? I found the dragon eggs. Is mom with you? The door is jammed and I can't get out of here. I'm still in a shelter looking sort of room. By the way, the code that you need to teleport is Bushlands. Try searching from your end. And no, mom isn't with me. I'm afraid she still might be with the doctor. Are any of the flying dragon eggs about ready to hatch yet? I found one that's almost ready to hatch. Got a new controller for PC. Nice. Did you get Did you get an Afterglow controller? <laughs> we, we just got two more Afterglow controllers. We did. We need to test them out and make sure they work well. Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't know, it's almost ready to hatch, but it's locked up with a pack. We do something about that? I didn't. Aw, oh, man. Bushland Structure D. Searching for functional teleporters. Trying Regular to... inference. <laughs> <laughs> Gillikit. Okay, I haven't heard of that. Anyhow, I'm on my way to, to help you. Just stay right there. Roger that. And do me a favor, bring some food back in your... <laughs> user suit is disconnected. Ah. <laughs> is that boy ready yet? <laughs> Welcome back. I've been waiting. Now what? I'm busy. Toroko has been taken to the doctor. What? And we're holding you responsible for this. Let go of me! Hello. Welcome back. Sue's returned and we locked her up inside a cage up top of the village. When the doctor's gang comes, we'll give them Sue in exchange for Toriko. Feel bad for Sue, but Toriko, she's one of us. We don't need someone like Sue who only thinks of herself and no one else. 
Yeah, that's fair. Uh, the first thing she said when I met her was, I hate this island and every living thing on it. So, yeah, I don't, uh, I don't have a ton of love for her. Yeah, why is Jack always pointing? Oh, I feel like it's because he he looks like a he looks like a soldier. He's got like, the green like you know bucket helmet and the goggles. I feel like he's supposed to have a gun, but he just doesn't have one, so he just does this. I think he's just like yeah, hundred <laughs> percent of the time. That's, yeah, I I think that's it. Oh, let me go up. Let me out of here now. Shut up. Toriko was taken by mistake because of you. One way or another, I'm handing you over to them. I hate you. Toriko isn't safe. I'm going to tear you apart. Wow. They're not solving their differences. They're doing great over there. Amicably. Oh, it's you. Who's been taken upstairs? Stairs? Is that what these are? <laughs> they said she's the reason Toriko was kidnapped. Yeah, what do you think of that? Eaten? That's only eaten. I've been caught. The doctor's men mistook another Mimiga for me and kidnapped her instead. Girl, Toriko, she treated me so well when I had trouble getting used to everything. I have an idea. You can go in my place. My brother Cosmo is stuck in an area called the Bushland. Bring him back here. Bring my brother here. You can go to Bushlands with the teleporter inside Arthur's house. Yeah, but you didn't tell me how. It was like a whole part of that cutscene where you learned how to do that and you didn't tell me. How am I supposed to know? Hi, King. This is what happens to those who defy the order of the village. Sounds great, King. You're doing a great job, buddy. Ow! I need something with protein. Good same. Should I just make us up some chicken nuggets? No, we should wait the last hour and a half. Really? Yeah. It's just a barbecue. It's not like we're going to have to be hungry for dinner time. I wonder when they're going to have food. Well, knowing my family, a little bit later than they had expected to. So. Which is not a criticism, by the way. My family makes amazing food. They do. It's just that we eat dinner late. <laughs> they do. <laughs> we're always like, we're going to have dinner at like 5.30 or 6, and it's ready, you know, like 6.37. How yeah. fast I can my, shoot this gun. My stomach is really uncomfortable today. Well, stomach isn't the right word. My, like, torso... It just feels really stretched out today. I'm gonna make this a little, little chicken nugget snack. Tide is over. Keep us streaming. Why don't you make up the rest of the fish? Okay. I don't know how many are left. But... Well, I'm gonna make you all. Wait, of them. I'll do it so you can progress the story bit. How many? You, can, you can play. Um. It's okay. Yeah, I'll do it. Are you sure? I don't want you to get up. No, it's okay. That'll rearrange the baby. Shake him up a bit Shake in there. Up there. Okay. Upstairs sounds better than up shaft. <laughs> True. They took her up shaft. <laughs> oh, I hope Toriko isn't hurt. Did she say rearrange the baby? Yeah. Yeah. She was saying she was a little uncomfortable. <laughs> Connection with Bushlands complete. It's a teleporter. Teleport to Bushlands. Yay! <laughs> hey, what's your deal? Hello. My name is Santa. Of course. I went to get some water and was attacked by those monsters, so I ran back home, but I dropped my key on the way back. Now I can't get into my own home. That sounds tough. <laughs> Location two out of five. Five, five, is a, five is a good number of locations to have in your game.
Obtained McDonald's key. There's no world in how are we gonna find Bowser? Oh, that's the key to my house. I returned it. Thank you. Please come over. I have something nice for you. All right. Santa's house. Yep. Sure enough. Is he called the Santa because he gives a gift? Danger. This trap is instant death. Use extreme caution. Why do you have this in your house, man? It's probably not actually instant death. I bet there's a secret in here. No, it was properly labeled. Santa because he had spikes in his house. Thanks again for the help earlier. I'd like to give you something. It's a fireball! Yeah, it's something nice for you. It's a gun. Are you looking for someone? I haven't seen anyone around here, but if you plan on going further in, you'll need to go through the fireplace in Chaco's house. Why will I need to do that? If you go through the fireplace in Chaco's house, you can get to the other side of the bush. Right. Flames billow. Charcoal burns in Santa's fireplace. Yeah, see? Santa, coal, you get it. Bro <laughs> spikes everyone for good vibes and keeps me humble. True. Oh, I should have I should have examined the, the key. We have a new gun. It's a gun that's affected by gravity. And like Super Mario, you can only have two fireballs out at once. Look at the little baby ones. Look at all this health I don't need. And now we get three fireballs, unlike Super Mario. It's a little tough to hit the flying guys with this one. Yeah, you gotta you gotta eat your Doritos. Very important. So this can't break blocks, I guess. We didn't program them to do that. I think I needed that block. Actually, no, I don't think having that block would help me do this. To make a pretty precise jump. Fit into that little one block gap. Oh, how, that looked so good. Oh. And then you have to then you have to Mega Man jump. Kinda tough. It is it is tough to jump like Mega Man. I'm getting better at getting into the block. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> um, it's add quote all one word for our system. It is, it is tough to jump like Mega Man, it's true. That's why Mega Man is such a good hero, because he can do it. It's <laughs> lucky he keeps actually pinning stuff. <laughs> or maybe that was on purpose. <laughs> oh. Wait, is that not how you get that? <laughs> Gonna wait, hold on. Is 
This is a way better way of getting that. Oh. I figured it out. I'm a genius. Hey, that increased it by five. Now I have... Wait, do I have a weird max? No, I think... I do have a level three fireball now. Now it's blue. And is slightly faster? Probably does more damage. Hey, that traps instant death. We learned about this. It's not a sprinkler. Is it just weird? Does that kind of look like a like a middle finger block? A little bit. <laughs> Yippee! Hey, put that out. Oh, my tummy is grumbling something fierce. Oh, is it? It is. Okay. And that's I why thought... I was advocating for it. Yeah. 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 I guess it's true that we don't really know when we're gonna eat food at the barbecue. Better to... Yeah, you said, oh, a... we'll wait an hour and a half, and I was like, uh-uh. <laughs> it's not going to be an hour and a half, Sarai. <laughs> no, I mean, even if it was an hour and a half, I was like, nope, can't do that. <laughs> I will die. <laughs> Hi, how may I help you? Well, that thing you have there looks quite dangerous. I wonder, are you a traveler? Uh, Miriam says, I beat Cave Story Core on hard mode after about 52 deaths. Hard mode means you have 3 HP. Nice. Our fam does hot the crackers and cheese, but you know, the obvious is slow K. You see a hole on the other side of the billowing flames. You can't get past the fire. Yeah, there's nothing, there's nothing wrong with, you know, having like, you know, kind of a slow start to dinner. That's yeah. that's generally, I think, considered more normal. Yeah. Um, we just want to make sure that we don't, we're not super cranky. <laughs> <laughs> you want to go through my fireplace? For that, you're going to need a bit of jellyfish juice. The big jelly has it. The big... What? Need some jellyfish juice. You can get your hands on some jellyfish juice from the jellies. Go for the biggest one. Yeah. Um, and then the, the creator. <laughs> yeah, I do know. The creator. I feel like this happened. I, I feel like I know why this happened. This particular joke. So you examine the fire. Chaco walks over to you yeah. to, to tell you how the fire works. Chaco is now on top, is now like basically on the bed sprite. So if you use the bed now. <laughs> You heard that noise? That noise that we got another item? Um... Chaco's Rouge. Red lipstick from Chaco has no use. We cuddled with Chaco. I feel like you went to sleep, Chaco was watching you sleep, and was like, that looks comfy. He just laid down next to you. That's a use for her. Fell, fell out of her pocket. No, it, it is my it is my souvenir. That's awful. <laughs> why is why is this little block here? What's maybe she maybe she slipped it into your pocket. <laughs> yeah, true. Maybe she like, oh, I'll, I'll give him some makeup tips. Oh, hey, sure enough, jellyfish. I guess I didn't notice the jellyfish earlier. I'm wondering why she uses red lipstick instead of purple or something, points out Miriam. <laughs> A valid question. Yeah, so I feel like that's how that came to be, is the, the creator noticed like, oh, haha, -ha, like Chaco is right over the bed. Like, wouldn't it be funny if... <laughs> wouldn't it be funny if... Hey, stop that. It's a whole- it's a- it's a dang jellyfish jamboree over here. It sure, it sure is. Jokes aside, snoozing with an Amigo would be cozy. That's true. And that's why you should buy this Amigo plush today from Fan Gamer. Jellyfish juice. <laughs> 
fan gamer. <laughs> Wait, actually, fan gamer doesn't really have license. Yet, but... What? Yeah, that's oh, all does? they have, right? Okay. I, I I know one of the websites has like real merch, and one website has a lot of stolen merch. I just can't shoot. Keep Red track. bubble. Red bubble. Fan gamer has legit. I went to look, nothing from Cave Stories is glow. Dang. Well, dang! Ow. Yeah, what happens if I go through your fireplace? Oh my. There's something within the ashes. Some charcoal! Removed from a fireplace. What are you gonna use that charcoal for? Oh my gosh. Um, I don't know. I just put I out your fire. Enjoy opening. being cold, you dork. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I keep, um... I keep, um, opening the calculator app on my phone instead of the clock app to set timers. So that's where my brain's at. Oh, There's never been official the plushies, it looks like. The main cave story related to the apparel I remember coming around was the limited edition USB drives. They're modeled after guns from the game. Nice. Well, there shouldn't be a plushie because they shouldn't be plush. They should be like... They should be like plastic. Because they're... Because they're... Robots. Only you and Curly are robots. Oh, I guess you can make me go. Oh yeah, let me get it. No matter. If you want to venture any further, be mindful of those big blue critters. They'll try to crush you. Oh yeah, I already figured that out. Are you just chilling up here, or, or like what? Oh look, if you leave, he closes his eyes. But if you show up, he's like what? He's got he's got the full white eyes. Cuddy Mamiga, cuddly Mamiga. He's just hanging out. This is Miri. He is. You could always buy a handmade Mimiga plush, though, it says Glow. That's true. And support small business at the same time. Count me in. You gonna get the bub line, asked Theory? I don't see why not. We can always... Wait, can you unequip it? The, the only reason I wouldn't want to get the bubble is because it becomes kind of irrelevant at a certain point, and then it's just kind of taking up a slot. Bubble Land is my favorite kingdom in Mario Odyssey. Exactly. Cave story reference in Mario Odyssey. Unnecessary red circle and red arrow. He's talking about like a YouTube thumbnail. <laughs> Hard mode players disagree, right? It's Tower Train. <laughs> Wait, can you? You cannot unequip weapons. Hmm. Oh, I'll get it. Why not? Whatever. Maybe it's really useful in sand zone, though, for any mode, right? Yeah. Okay. Time to put out this fire. There's something buried within the ashes. It's a gun! Somebody threw away their gun dramatically and then was like, Oh, I liked that gun. I bet it was Jack. Hey, I went to the bushlands and your uh, brother wasn't there. They're not coming. Oh, interesting. This actually does kind of progress in the meantime. Yes, did you find my brother? The king says they're not coming. He's he's getting a little frustrated. He finally has her to trade back, and they don't they don't like they're not trying to kidnap her anymore. Uh, this is a story play. The real question is, who left that gun there? I bet it was Jack, because... Hmm, Jack seems like a guy who loses melee. <laughs> I mean, King? Yeah, no, definitely King. Because we know King's weapon of choice.
What are you looking up? What to do when my tummy hurts. Well, really, my belly hurts. Because it's too stretched. It's too stretched. That sucks. Wait, uh, just one more thing. If you examine the flowers when somebody's in there, comment on it or something, maybe. Kellen's in there swinging. Mm. Nope, just flowers with three question marks. Just so goofy. It's a teleporter. Strained muscles. I think that's what's happening. I think that the, this... Whatever is whatever is here I would do it. is strange. And I use pop pad on Ellie while pregnant. Um, the the bubble shooter does this when you hold down the button. It's a real good gun. One says yes, and the other says no. This is what happens when you Google stuff while you're pregnant. They'll be like, I take allergy meds while pregnant, and then one result will be like, yeah, one result will be like, no. So what I really could do is phone up. The, phone up. Phone up. The advice line for my, for my doctor's visit, doctor's thing. You can call the advice nurse for free and say, Hi, can I use a hot pad on my belly for a few minutes? And they will tell me. The other thing is, different OBGYNs say different things. <laughs> Maybe try leveling it up. Oh, if you insist. Deep fried, baby! Okay, I think it's okay for a I few minutes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. I'm not gonna do it to my skin. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna just do it over my my tummy. Cause it hurts. Okay. Hey, now it's a fully automatic gun, and it's kind of. I'm gonna like bake a... the baby. You guys are making me feel like a horrible parent. Feel better quick, says Glow. It actually immediately feels really nice. I mean, you are allowed to take uh, warm baths. You just can't take hot baths. You can't go into hot tubs. And, then, and I don't have the and hot now, tub very high. The bubbles. Oh, that feels really nice. They become a cloud, and then you release the button, and it shoot the cloud. Shoot. However, um. The ammo is limited. You can see up there, you have to let it recharge by not firing it. Um, Ellen is definitely reacting to the surface temperature being a little bit warmer. And also the level three. Uh, it has very little, like, shield. Oh, I so, see. Uh, so the, you, you will... There are not many Doritos in the level three bar. You will drop them almost immediately. Did you get the jellyfish juice? Great work! Although you can well, carry only one jar of jellyfish juice, you can get it over and over again from the jellies. Zephyr's rooting for you, by the way, says Heck yeah. Dorito list bubbles. Oh. Okay. It stopped hurting, so I'm gonna I'm gonna remove the heat pad. Dorito list. Ellen felt very warm and snug. Ugh. This area is dangerous. There's a Mamiga in chat right now. <laughs> Hello, Avril Mamiga. I'm guessing you're a fan of this game. Oh, like everything. I hate this do. island and everything in it. <laughs> Wonder what gave that away, says Evriel. <laughs> One way jump. Now I can't get back up there. 
But hey, at least there's a power supply room. It's locked. Never the mind. The bubble of bubbles seems like a good defense. Attacking an enemy projectiles is the best defensive play. That way the bubbles behind you can be utilized. This is kind of great. Frogs. These are enemy frogs, unfortunately. The little, the little drool coming out of their mouth. Yeah. I don't know so what those little dudes are. Do you even them, know though. what they are? Dang. Do we even know what we are? God, I hope so. I can jump up to the top of this bit. Hey! Hey! Okay, fine. Oh. Max missiles increase. The first of many. It Did won't. Alex just pull the what are we on his wife? <laughs> what are we? The credits tell you what the enemies are, that's true. Yeah, enemy roll call. Someone in that crevice. Hey you boy, I need to get out of here. Would you um please help me? What's in it for me? I see, what a shame. <laughs> He's too polite. He's like, oh, well, okay. <laughs> okay, fine, I'll help you. Thanks, please take this. Oh, rusty key. Well, okay, you should have said so. I didn't know there was a key in it for me. Left in this room. Go ahead and use it if you can. Rusty key, that's great. Maybe I'll have to find something to use it. Is on. it some kind of bike? Old keyblade, Sabriel. <laughs> it's like a really small one. Yeah, has anyone drawn? I'm sure this exists. Like Sora or whoever, like using like a like key-sized keyblade. This is called the execution chamber. I wonder why it's called that. Ah! <laughs> Who can say? It's a mystery. Ooh, the chicken nuggets might be almost done. Yeah. The fish sticks said they would take a bit longer. A nun. Wait, what's that? I feel it's like I should recognize that word. There we go. Yeah, get ready. But none are enemies that can only be found in the main part of Bushlands. Oh. Man, man. There's a song about these guys. It goes do 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 do. Mana mana. <laughs> the fans have been stopped. Someone turned off the power. If you want to turn them back on, look for the power supply room. Okay. That makes sense to me. I shall go check on nuggets. Good luck. Mm. The right has no relevance to the story yet. Please, let's not get political in chat. I can't find Sora with a key-sized keyblade. <laughs> Dang. I have to learn how to art so I can make that. Or I can just put that into Gardic Phone next time we play it. <laughs> it's a robot. Looks like it's not powered on. Oh, that makes sense. If it was powered on, it would probably try to attack me. Fan power supply offline. Malco power supply offline. What's a Malco? Turn the power on? Yeah, okay, sure. Oh, right. He's scary. Intruder sighted. Terminate immediately. Boss time. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Suitcase man, you saved me. Did you know that the meet me guy I found wasn't Sue? Yeah? Yep. She wasn't Sue. Because of that, the doctor was extremely upset. Misery received quite the beatdown. Pity, since she's just a girl. Why does that, why does that, why is this happy? Happy face when he says that. Dor Duke Doris Scratch Sounder, do you? 
Well, the master can't be disobeyed, so that's our fate. This time, I'm here to break you for real. Better prepare yourself. Oh, what? I can't just tell you I don't want to fight again? He can fly just like the little guys! Bubbly is pretty good for him. He can fly like the little guys in the in the bushlands. Getting <laughs> passive aggressive. Getting passive aggressive. What are you? Defeated Balrog. Power supply operation normal. Okay. Hey, buddy. The head's been crushed in. Its body is jammed into the floor. Wanna pull its body out? Uh, yeah. Kinda didn't deserve that. The Thank you. You are a good person. And on top of that, so strong! Thank you for saving me. But did I, I don't think I really saved you, dude. You look pretty not saved. You do blink, though, which is a little weird, seeing as how you're a robot. I don't think robots blink. Who squinched? <laughs> He's... Hold on. I need to I I need to do this even though I'm I'm not supposed to be in the chat. I am in the chat. It didn't work. Wait, no, it did work. It it worked for people that aren't me. For some reason mine is <laughs> There we go. <laughs> I would like to do something for you to express my gratitude. But with that said, I am only capable of making bombs. Dude, this guy's boss fight would have been so cool. He would have been, like, making bombs and throwing them at us. It's too bad. Balrog ruined it. What a jerk. I could use a bomb. Maybe not. On second thought, maybe bombs are overrated. Balrog is one thing he does good in the entirety of Cave Story. That's not true! He does two good things! <laughs> he does two good things. Come on. Give him some credit. Woo! That's a good jump. Bushlands Hut. Uh-oh. Somebody's beating the red flowers. At least I get some max missiles. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm not trying to examine that right now. Oh, he only took like three missiles to defeat. <laughs> Empty! I don't think that's supposed to be. I There's nothing there. Oh, I forget. I think you can examine this before you get ambushed. Um... <laughs> Bowling at the Furley Gates. <laughs> I did too good. I think you can um, examine this before you get ambushed, and it says, like, there's something there. I like that the execution chamber on the outside is as tall on, as it is on the inside. That's good attention to detail. Ow. Oh, we don't have the... Whoops, I should have picked up those missiles. I was examining a thing. You, you, um... We don't have the... Mega Man thing, where if you hold the... If you, like, press the left and right weapon switch buttons at the same time, it just swaps back to your, like, basic weapon. But let me tell you something. If you hold down the jump button while being propelled by a fan, you'll go even higher. That's pretty great. Thanks, man. I kind of figured that out already, though. I want these. Look at these owl blocks. This is really nice owl block texture. Oh. Kind of 
have screwed that up. Didn't screw it up twice though. Never mind, it's locked. Gum is written on the door. Dag got it. Everything around here is locked. I just find it interesting when there are NPCs, but there could have just been a sign. Yeah, that guy says two things though, so a sign can't really do that unless it's like a special sign. Please open the door. There's no keyhole. It's rusted. What do you mean it's not the right key for that door? Well, that's upsetting. Oh, you thought the rusty key was for that door. It was not. There's no keyhole. We need to break it down. There has to be a better way. Okay. The video game equivalent of that could have been an email. I'm not sure if I made you enough nuggets. That's okay. I... Yeah, just enough to tide me over. That's fine. Thank you. Yay. Huh. I could... I probably feel a little more. No! So it's like oh, when you're really hungry, someone puts food in front of you. <laughs> I told you not to take a bite. Too bad. My sweet, foolish husband. He's as foolish as me. I just remember last time you served yourself nuggets, you did ranch and honey mustard, so that's what I gave you. Thank you. But Normally more... I just do honey mustard. Oh. Mmm. But I do like the ranch. Mmm, maybe it's because you had corn dog. Yeah. You weren't expected to know that, though. Thank you. Um, I also forgot to read the, uh, uh, the, the guns. Polar Star, your very first gun. It carries the mark of the Northern Star. Did Missile Launcher. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I did. Okay. Just Long down. range arm dealing big damage. The downside, limited ammunition. Fireball. Its projectiles bounce on the ground. Quite useful on slopes. And bubbling, found in the assembly hall fireplace. Use it as you like. <laughs> That's the equivalent of just being like, I, I don't, I don't know what niche this serves in the game. Just use it Figure if you it want. Out. I don't care. Yeah. Hey, I need to break down a door. You want to open the rusty door? What? Someone is trapped inside? You definitely are a good person. I understand. Let's make a bomb then. We will demolish that door. I love this robot's attitude. I know, right? You're a good person. I'll make you a bomb. I, like... I, I want to bring this guy around with me on adventures. Mm-hmm. Curly can go have her own adventure. <laughs> you can, you can play the game from her perspective. Charcoal, jellyfish juice, and gum base. Eh, it's not really from her perspective, more as it is um, with her and our main character's uh, positions switched. Oh, never mind. Let us make the bomb once all the materials have been amassed. Okay. I will need another jelly juice. You need to get the jelly juice four times. Can you believe that? I can. Got all them bats. Ow. It's okay though, we don't need the jellyfish juice to get through the elevator anymore. We fixed that. Yeah, the level three bubbly can only hold like four Doritos or something. Ah! I was in the insta-kill spikes, but it's okay because invincibility frames. <laughs> That's right. Sample health, rope, bombs. You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough materials, Zavriel. <laughs> yes, come over here. 
Look at this jelly. It's like evil. Mm-hmm. It can tell because the red eyes. There's something wrong with this jellyfish, dude. <laughs> I didn't give myself enough sauce. Who made it this I way? I have to go get more. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> give me this. Dooba 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 doo. I'm out of here. There's too many people. Yeah. Hi, Chaco. I'm gonna rest real quick. Chaco, you are my very best friend. I'll never forget the time we spent together. <laughs> oh, good. Or maybe more. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Whoa. Hey. All bats, please leave. Damn it! I got ketchup on my gas! I was gonna grab a missile when I went by, but I sure didn't do that. I got two out of three. We can make a pretty good bomb with that, right? Mm, nope. Okay. Well, that's fine. Hey, Bab! <laughs> eat my chicken now and it won't be too hot. I was so right. Also, I was riding on top of that guy. <laughs> It's rusted as usual. What, use a bomb on that door? I guess that's a possibility. Right. So you're looking from the materials? Did you say gum base? Wait a sec. Take this. The gum key. Whoa. It's a key made of gum. Whoa. It was hanging on the wall. The word gum was written on it. I'm sure it must be related somehow. I'm counting on you, boy. <laughs> I guess I'm not gonna tell him my name. Combat all bats. <laughs> Nice, slow okay. Sounds good, slow okay. We'll see you around then. That's all right. I run out of dialogue sometimes too. Well. I read a tweet that was like, um, it was a, uh, it was a girl said, I I started uh, telling my boyfriend a story I had already told him, and it, um, and once I realized it. I said sorry, and he said, No, it's okay, this is good. It means I've heard all your dialogue, and now I can progress the story. <laughs> Breaking into a <laughs> Gun key. Wow, well, I bet you nothing bad happens in this room. I gotta say it like that. I can just leave. <laughs> A lot of times they lock you into rooms like this. Okay. Um, open the treasure chest. 
gum base. Great. Oh, hello. Are you available for voice acting? Um, after this bite, I will be. Okay, cool. I'll take a bite too. Solidarity. Mm -hmm. In in solidarity. Mm -hmm. Keep that in my back pocket. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Hey, you again, do you remember me? No. That's right, in the Mega Village. I didn't notice at the time, but now I remember. Aren't you that soldier from the surface? People seem to think that. I don't know how you were able to stay alive. Misery! I mean, we barely did, we lost our memory. That's the enemy! He might even be stronger than you, Misery. That's so... She's yeah. like, yeah, you want to bet? She disagreed. <laughs> well, it's a good thing this soldier is your job. Break him for sure this time, then come back. Oh, oh frog! She turned him into a frog. Frog. Ah, oh, he's an invincible frog. Shoot him in the mouth! Yes! It won't open! Well, hungry. why the heck not? Hey, a frog fell on me. That's not fair. Aww. Shoot the missiles into his mouth! In order to kill him. I wasted some missile. Give me that. <laughs> Ow! The frog fell on me! Again. Not fair. There we go. Eat it! That's right. Okay, see you later. <laughs> he can jump better when he's not a frog. That's funny. still hungry, which I know was the point. Oh, you don't have to do that. I only gave you eight. <laughs> Maybe you're a princess? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe the polar star is a princess. Mm -hmm. Twas her kiss. That cured his frogginess. <laughs> I sure wish those two would stop ruining all my plans. Mm -hmm. Is that bomb ready yet? <laughs> hey, I'm doing all the work out here. You better be grateful. Jellyfish jelly. A fluid that can extinguish fires. Gum key. It has the word gum. Gum base. It's a piece of gum. <laughs> That's just the room where they store the chewing gum. Yep. Jack blowing on that finger he keeps holding out exactly. <laughs> He's always ready to go. What you don't know is that he, he can just cast like a magic spell out of his fingers. <laughs> He's just keeping it ready at all times. We gathered all the materials. Oh, it's some charcoal and jellyfish juice. The gum base too. I will commence making the bomb immediately. Yeah, you do that, bud. You do that. It's complete. The bomb. Bam. Now go and blow up that door. It's a bomb for blowing up doors. It's a very specific type of bomb to be able to make. I really wouldn't know what would separate that from like an ordinary bomb. So I'm really glad I had this guy to help me.
Is that bomb ready yet? The bomb has been set. <laughs> All right. Yeah. You did well, boy. Just one look and I knew. I knew you could do it. Um, my name is Kazuma Sakamoto, but please call me Kazuma. Luckily, I was able to escape from the doctor, but then I was teleported here. Felt like I was about to die of total starvation. You're a real lifesaver. By the way, have you heard of a place called Mimiga Village? Sue? You know Sue! I see. So you've come to get me in place of Sue. I understand. No. Let's go. Take me to the village. The bomb for the door. The bomb chose me especially to destroy the door. The door is bomb. That bomb? Yes, that bomb! <laughs> And the teleporter finally starts working. Yep. Is that you, Kazuma? Professor Booster, so you're safe. Yes, somehow. <laughs> he looks a little rabbity already. He does. And how's Sue? Is she safe? Sue's in Mimiga Village. This boy will get us there. Oh. Do you know him? No. Um, actually, we just met. Wait. Anyway, let's hurry and get to Sue's location. <laughs> this hasn't been explained yet in the story. Why, um, is Mr. Mamiga and he's human? Don't think that's been explained in the story yet. And I don't think I know why. Um, I think maybe the doctor did it. That's probably the answer for everything. Oh, Sorty Or! Sorty Or! 61! 60. That is 12 freaking years. No, it's not. <laughs> I meant... I meant 5 years. Because <laughs> I was doing 5 times 12, so the number 12 was in my head. What did she ask? Uh, why is Sue a Yeah, Mimiga? Sardier's been subscribed for longer than Red's had a stream. <laughs> Yeah, you, you now have the five-year badge, the golden two-orb card. Alex's face when I said that. <laughs> it's like, oh, my sweet love. I love those. Those are so great. Two months left in November. Um. <laughs> You're so dumb, too. <laughs> what was the one from this recent Cliffies? Um, I uh, forgot that there's 12 inches. Oh, yeah, that's only one less than I'm 16. such a big fan, I said before I even could, was personally writing it. <laughs> I've got a treat for you. Can you come up here so you can get it? That's that's good enough, I think. That's from Sortiar, it's for you. Yeah, no, oh, your mouth was wet because you were drinking water, that's great. <laughs> yeah, I love you. I love you no matter how slobbery you are. The slobbier is better, really. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> the doctor has started to gather in the Mimiga. It appears he's taken notice of the red flowers. But Sue is a... Will the red flowers work on Sue as well? Just like the others? Azuma, the doctor has commenced snatching the Mimiga. Do you understand what this means? The doctor in the war? That's right. And now we're the only ones who can stop him. But how are we going to stop the doctor? I have an idea. At any rate, let's hurry and get back to Sue. We'll discuss when we're there. I want you to come too. He, he like pushes us aside. Yeah, probably like a, uh, an experiment. Yeah, I don't know if it's actually stated. I think it is. There is a human Sue, um, like, portrait, talking portrait in the game that went unused, I think. Interesting. Yeah. Use of this teleporter is currently suspended. The one-way teleporter. I shot a Roman candle in pool. It is hot. Are we doing M3 tomorrow still? Yes. Red and 11 stream. Aw, oh, yeah. Coming to the Friday. Like, you can't, like, find the crack in the wall. Aw, oh, yeah. I'm counting on you. Lead us to Mimiga Village. Kazuma. Yes? 
Does that thing work? Oh shit, it's the Doritos game since I like- Yeah. <laughs> you know it is. Yeah, today, to, or not today, uh, this year will be its 20th anniversary in December. Pretty freaking awesome. So we're just doing a playthrough of it because I watched Vinny beat the true ending and I've never beat the true ending. And if Vinny Vinesauce can do it, baby gamer, I can. I didn't know this was going to involve dissing a big streamer. Oh, I mean, it. you know, Vinny, he played the baby game. He did not shoot. Shoot the gun. <laughs> you haven't? No. As a, as a teen, I played this game and I played, uh, I like beat the game normal. And then I, um, I played, actually, I played the game first. I decided to play it on easy mode. Um, and I beat the game with the Mimiga mask on because I thought that was funny. Then I went for a normal playthrough and decided to try and get the true ending. And I'm, um, yeah, and and I, I wanted to do it without using a guide because I thought that would be more fun. Um, so I mostly rescued um, Curly, and then did not take her with me because I didn't understand that you had to do that because it's intentionally. Like, obtuse. It is. That is one thing about these early games, is that that can happen in the story sometimes, where it's a little ridiculously... To prove you're a real gamer, you should be on hard mode. It's the baby gamer now. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then, uh, later I replayed it um, to actually get the true ending. And I tried uh, Hell and Balos a couple times, and I was like, "Nah, I don't like this. This isn't fun. I'm I quit." <laughs> and I never did it. But now, now I'm a better gamer. They didn't take me. It won't stop. Maybe you should be grateful they didn't take you. I wanted to go. Aww. <laughs> oh, quote. <laughs> good sounds, good sounds. I own this game on 3DS, and I find Hell impossible on that system. Not on the original. Go figure. Oh. Please come and visit again, even if I can't serve you any tea. Okay. Thanks for the bomb. A real good job with the bomb. Crowd controlled! Yeah. I bet it's just the precision required is afterglow. Yeah, there are there are a few pretty tough jumps. Got guns. No longer a pixel art game, you know. That's funny, she just has a different thing based on whether you have jellyfish juice or not. Yeah, that's the one where where you have the 3D graphics, right? Maybe that's why I can't dodge the spikes on 3DS as low. Hence it being on the 3DS. Yeah. Oh no, I'm out of bubbles. What the heck? That bike Kazuma was riding looks like it has had better days. Oh no. Fair enough. Santa, did you hear that? I heard a crash of some kind. Then what sounded like someone screaming. Probably unrelated. Yeah. I'm sure everybody's... on the 4th of July. <laughs> oh no. We're weapons of death? Yes. The doctor plans to 
use the red flower to have all of you attack the humans. Why would he do such an awful thing? Doctor's like a devil. Will he force Toriko to eat the red flower? Doctor is still searching for the red flower. It's good if he hasn't found the location yet. What if, if he finds the red flower, Toriko will be... She'll be filled with rage and turn into a weapon of death. Cookie, cookie Man, man. Raid! What's up, Shout Cookie Man? Shout out to Cookie! I won't let that happen! Ouch. Are you okay? Yes, but I really thought that we weren't going to make it. <laughs> Booster tends to go there pretty quick. Cookie Man has been streaming some Elden Ring! We Join got us. our ass kicked super hard this time. Go follow Cookie Man! I may have gotten mad! Your, ma your madness was definitely warranted. Cookie is mad, part four. <laughs> Cookie Man, you can't get mad at, at Elden Ring, don't you know? Every time you get mad at a FromSoft game, uh, Miyazaki grows more powerful. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, that <laughs> he, explains everything. He, he feeds off anger and hatred. <laughs> like, a, like a true from soft boss. <laughs> Kazuma and Professor Booster. Oh! They don't even explain where Professor Booster came from. How have you been? Surviving. And that maybe, guys. <laughs> His name is King leader of the village and also a friend of mine. Many of me used to live here in Mamiga Village. Most of them were taken away to the doctor. His friends were also. We always come after the dialogue, but it's okay. We, we, we somehow heard it. Okay? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Yeah, nobody cares. It'd be funny if we just drowned <laughs> underneath there. <laughs> <laughs> like a kid in the pool that no one's watching. <laughs> got really dark. <laughs> oh no. The bike's a complete wreck, but somehow we made it. Were you hoping to get their bicycles, or were you hoping to leave that? Mm, we could we could probably save and quit here. <laughs> the doctor's scheme is moving along as planned. We need to hurry and do something about it. Welcome back! Looks like I owe you yet another one. With Cosmo here, I'm sure we'll be able to handle the password for that egg. Professor Booster, can you bring him along? Prof <laughs> Professor Booster's like, uh. <laughs> Professor. Sue. Our escape must be put on hold for now. The doctor has found the location of the red flowers. <sighs> huh? As of yet, he doesn't have his hands on them, but it's only a matter of time before he does. Their location is in Sand Zone. I've heard that the red flowers are there. Sand Zone? So if we go there, will we find the Doctor? Um, I fear that it's the Doctor's minions that will presumably go. We must eradicate the red flowers before they get their hands on them. However, Sand Zone is a very dangerous place. If we were to go, whether or not we can make it back alive isn't... Are you giving up, then? Actually, no. We have just the right person here with us now. You. What is he? They sure are talking about us in third person. Uh, well. Second person, actually. He's an armed recon robot that was dispatched to this island ten years ago. <laughs> I'm like... Oh, I am? Oh, no, cool. No kidding. This is news to me. <laughs> Lost audio there for a second. I unplugged that one safety clip, though. You tell me the longer Miyazaki stays in the studio, the stronger he will become. <laughs> yes. How many times do I have to say it? <laughs> a robot? I had heard they were all destroyed after the war. However, I don't know the exact details. Perhaps one of them... Professor, I've connected us to the Sand Zone teleporter. Hmm. You are the most ideal among us here to search the island. Please help us. Uh... Okay. Sand zone, huh? Travel to sand zone with this teleport. Among us, Tiki, Red Cookie Man. Burn them all. <laughs> Among us. There are no more red flowers. We can hopefully avoid the war. Well, that's a pretty heavy responsibility, you think? Cookie Man redeemed. Spin, Spin the, the wheel. wheel. 
You are the one from ten years ago, aren't you? I didn't realize it at all until just now. You are indeed well made. <laughs> Thank you. Ten years ago. When Kazuma tells you you're well made, I just knocked the headphone cord in. Nice. I need to get this plate made. Okay, did I save? I did just save, didn't I? I'm gonna do it again. Slow K style. Okay. Slow K is gonna be proud. Um, there we go. <clears throat> just all tabbing, does it? Okay, where's. Never mind, it just makes it quiet, I guess. I don't think this dress is gonna dry in time. I think I'm gonna switch dresses. But at least I saved it from getting stained. I have with us today the fantastic, magical, wonderful prize wheel! Let's give it a spin. Hey, what's up, Vex? Cookie Man has just won a fantastic prize. It's a tarot reading. Ah, we will gaze into the cookie man's future. I see. All right, cookie man. I'm going to shuffle up these here cards as the uh, as the stars direct. Um, then you're going to tell me if you want a card from the top, the middle. Or the bottom of the deck. Left is not a is not a valid. Option. Cookie Man already knows his <laughs> future. The facts. Die to Elden Ring bosses. <laughs> True. Hold them sideways and then choose left. I guess I can do that. <laughs> okay. All right. Here we go. Holding them sideways and choosing the left one. I know that's your right, but it's my left, okay? Mir mirrors. This isn't fucking Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh! Wow, congratulations, Cookie Man. You got a major arcana. That's actually pretty rare. You got the magician. That's the one, that's the one on the front of the box! What does that mean? Ooh. Oh, that's that's an extremely strong mental image of your great skills and powerful influence over the world around you. You will be able to influence your future a great deal using only your strength of will. Especially like your brain power. I'm getting I'm getting real strong brain power vibes. The pro tag card, the main character of Tarot. It's true. <laughs> oh wow, that's that's a that's that's a very rare tarot reading. Brain power the hit song could be. Okay, yeah, I think I think we will get ready to head over to uh, to our Fourth of July barbecue. Um, sorry, it was a short one, but uh, we'll play more of this in the future, and we'll do we'll do the whole thing. We'll do the the true ending and everything. Um, I'm probably not gonna show the other endings except for like the fake ending that's not actually a real ending. Um. How is this 20 years old? Yeah, um, it's uh, it came out the same year that Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door did. Isn't that funny? That is so cool, though. Yeah, it's relevant. Sorry for that noise. Yep. Thought that would fit. It's okay. Um, 
Oh. Like, yeah. Dang, we have one friend live, but he's ending soon. Should we raid Damn him it. just, just, just for the laughs? <laughs> he might feel bad, though. <laughs> That's true. Oh, he's already started his raid. There's no way we can raid him in time. He's waving. He's gonna mm. click the button any second now. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> okay. Joy Explosions Day, make Duke's deafness bless him with a restful day. True. Yes, absolutely. Um, yeah, that's all I got for today. Tomorrow, we are going to be playing more Super Mario Brothers 3. Yes, you did, Crispy. I'm sorry. It's a short one today. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, more Super Mario Brothers 3 with 11 FTX tomorrow. Um, and then on Saturday... Viewer veins? Viewer games. Viewer games! That's what I said. Um, game reviews. Game, <laughs> That's something else. Game reviews? <laughs> no, viewer games. Thank you so much for the raid, Cookie Man. Uh, yeah, thank you for the raid, Cookie Man. Sorry that it was <laughs> right as we were ending stream, but you know, it's okay. Um, and, uh, yeah. That's all I got for you today. Catch y'all next time. Bye-bye.